My name is Alexandra Hoek Murray and I'm the Executive Director at Community Living Oakville. Community Living Oakville is a not-for-profit organization dedicated to supporting people with developmental disabilities in all aspects of their lives. We provide supported living services across 19 homes, primarily in Oakville, where over 80 people live with their roommates. In these homes, with the support of our dedicated staff, people receive support in daily living activities, such as meal preparation, personal care, and supports to reach individual goals. In addition to supported living, we proudly support over 40 people who live in a supported independent living model. People either live on their own or with a roommate and receive ongoing support to lead healthy and fulfilling lives. Our dedicated staff work hand in hand with them to achieve personal goals. Furthermore, we offer community participation supports that enable people to actively engage in a variety of activities throughout the day. These activities are designed to promote social inclusion, personal growth, and overall well-being. We provide both ministry-funded and fee-for-service options, ensuring that our services are accessible to as many people as possible. And lastly, but certainly not least, our agency takes great pride in our Explore Employment Support Services. Under this program, our job coaches provide support to over 150 people in employment planning, job development, and on-the-job training to ensure people are successful in their roles. Meet some of the incredible people we support. Their dreams and goals drive us every day. What are the things that you love to do? What really brings joy into your heart? Spend time with my girls. Yeah. Seeing my families in Ottawa. We just had a new member of the family born and a boy, so. And to be able to serve dinner, Christmas dinner, and having time with my son and family. Most people with developmental disabilities live on the poverty line. Simple indulgences, such as going out for a meal or getting a coffee, are a special treat, since people do not have enough remaining funds after paying for basic monthly needs. If you had extra money, what would you spend it on? On ice cream. I'll go for coffee. For food? I'll drink or uh, uh, a sack. The first thing that I would buy would be I'd replace uh, broken furniture. Um, one of them is I really need um, a bedroom set. Uh, just new dressers, drawers. Um, I think I've had mine since I was 16, so they're in bad shape. Where do you get most of your food? Fair Share Food Bank or the Christian Industries or my friend from Frontline Outreach. I want to say me and Living Local is the best. They, they support people like us. And you know what? Without them, we don't know what to do. Hi, my name is Laura Marin. Um, I have a sister with Down syndrome. Um, she is uh, seven years older than me. And we're from Mexico City. Uh, she lived with my parents. When my parents first passed away, my father, and then um, three years after my mom passed away. It was very hard because it's not only, you know, um, living the loss of your mom which is like the most important person in the world you know i think for every child um but also you know bringing ruthie and you know what that entitled because i work full time my husband works full time i had two daughters but at that time you know they were um younger right so we we're like okay what do we do? So after a few days after she had arrived, um, I called uh, the, the Halton Down Syndrome Association mm -hmm. and I said, you know, is, is there like a school or a program that I can, you know, get her in? And, and so finally they told me community living. So I came here to this building. I was really desperate. Mm -hmm. um, you know, because obviously Ruth was also, you know, coming to a new country and missing my mom and all this. So um, everybody was so welcoming and so warm and so loving. Um, Ruthie absolutely loved it since day one. She's wow. extremely happy. She feels it's, 
you know, like family. It's been such an amazing experience. I don't know what I would have done, honestly. Like, without you guys, you've, you've saved my life. <laughs> really? Community Living Oakville provides support to over 300 people with developmental disabilities and their families where most rely on government assistance via the Ontario Disability Support Program. This modest income only provides basic necessities such as rent and food costs. Together, we can turn dreams into reality. Community Living Oakville. Dream, inspire, belong.